We are here at uh, day two of the 2022 Biostock Life Science Summit, and I'm joined by the chairman of Pain Drainer, Carl Borbeck. Welcome, Carl. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, what, what does it mean for you especially and for a company like Pain Drainer to attend an event like this today? I mean, this is a, this is a quite unique event and um, gathering so many companies uh, with investors. Uh, I think it's unique for Sweden actually and even Nordic uh, to have so much in the ecosystem around innovation. And obviously for us, I mean, I have several of my companies at Medicom Village and Pain Drainer is one of them. It's obviously, you know, it's a melting pot. I talked to all the investors and um, it, it's um, in a very short period of time you get so many contacts. So, um, so it's great. Yeah, and uh, well, just, just uh, for more specifics uh, regarding Pain Drainer, what, what problem do you solve? I mean, we address the problem with chronic pain and chronic pain is a, a tr tremendous problem, 190 million people in the US and EU are suffering from chronic pain. So what we do, we don't, we don't cure chronic pain, but we, we develop an, a digital tool. So uh, using that, we've shown in three clinical trials in the US that the physical function increases, depression uh, decreases, uh, pain interference, which is quality of life, increased dramatically. And this is just by showing the patients what activity are connected with pain so they they can manage their pain in a much better way and uh, this is actually the first digital tool available and it's uh, we're going to launch it in the US in Q1 next year as a remote therapeutic monitoring device and the FDA has come up with uh, possibilities of doing that now with uh, also very attractive potential for reimbursement would you say that digital tools such as this one are, are the future of uh, uh, therapeutics, let's say? I mean, I think the digital tool in the, not like telemedicine, because that's basically just using uh, digital um, tools to do the same thing as you do today. But in the next wave, as we are in the next wave, uh, you open up accessibility, um, it's affordable, 30% of all primary care visits are in pain, uh, chronic pain. So this is a, this is a completely new way of, of uh, addressing that problem. Yeah, and uh, it, it's, it's definitely very exciting. And uh, what, what, what comes next for Pain Drainer? What are some of the milestones that you're most looking forward to at the moment? I mean, it's, it's a tremendous market, but I think the, our main focus is business to business. So uh, we've shown now in the last um, clinical trial that the ability to increase workload for the, for the patients or the subjects increased dramatically. So this is exactly what the employers would like to see, obviously, having their, um, th their people coming back into work. And this is also a unique selling point for us because nobody else has shown that. So in our contacts with big, big companies, this is what we... What we um, trying to convince them to, to, to use is highly affordable uh, and, uh, and um, has a great effect. So the next step is obviously the RTM in the US, but also business to business here in the, um, Scandinavia. Well, that sounds great. And we definitely look forward to following Pain Drainer as, as things move along. And uh, thank you so much, Carl, for, for joining us today. And we hope you enjoy the rest of the event. Thank you very much. Nice, nice talking to you. Thank you.